10% luck, 20% skill, 15% concentrated power of will, 5% pleasure, 50% pain, and 100% reason to remember the name. Hi all, Tuesday here, and this week on The Rebels, we are celebrating the birthday of one of our own. It is Danny Marks's book launch week, and in fact, I'm lucky enough to have his book launch day. Today, Velveteen is out in bookstores everywhere, and you should go get it. This is a horror book with heart. Personally, I can't wait to read it. In honor of his birthday, this week we are talking about book launches and signings, and providing all kinds of information to you guys about them. For my launch party in August, I of course made spreadsheets. You guys know me. This is me. I do that kind of thing. I overplan things. And so I went and even made a color palette for my party that matched my cover. As you guys know, If I Lies, black and white with a little speck of red. And so that was my color palette, all grays, black, and red. And so for my party, I had planned right down to flowers. We had a southern theme because the book is set in um, North Carolina. So we had sweet tea and a cheese plate and um, cake pops that were really good, which were red velvet, by the way. My niece and my sister made those. And then we also had a candy bar got mason jars filled them all with different candies got little scoops and I had little labels across everything that were chalkboard paint I had been planning my party for a good year I had been collecting little inspiration images on Pinterest to try and decide what I wanted to do and it worked out really well for me I tend to do everything on my own and not let people help me and I was really blessed by friends and family who wouldn't let me say no. They volunteered to do things and really came out and helped me to make that day special. My sister and my niece came out five days in advance and stayed with me. My friend Carrie um, did the cheese plate and just generally came out and um, ran us all around and helped to get stuff to the party and helped set up. My mom and my older brother were here and surprised me for the party and they helped put things together. And we also did swag bags. I had um, 50 plus swag bags that had things that were themed along with the party. Um, so sending a letter to a soldier and bookmarks and stickers and a little sweet tea kit so people can make sweet tea at home. It was a lot of fun to put together, but it was a lot of work. I think that my major takeaway from doing a launch party would be to do as much in advance as you can. Don't leave it all till the last minute. And let people help you. Let them um, be part of your day. I found that that was what was most special was because I let go and let family and friends in to help support me. It became really their day as well. And that was huge. Made it really special. In other news, just wanted to say really quick, um, because things have been so crazy since If I Lie came out and Touched is only a month and a half from coming out, I have decided to take the rest of October off. To that end, I won't be vlogging the rest of the month. And Megan Bostick, a fellow class of 2K12 friend and somebody who has filled in for me in the past, is going to be vlogging in my place through October. So please make sure to give her a warm welcome. Thanks, guys. Bye.